bakit ngayon lang na-award natin? I think, two months ago na siya nanalo, di ba? Pero, ba't matagal? Ano yung process na kailangan? Uh, kasi, medyo nag-easy kami no, noong uh, first quarter of the year. So, ngayon kasi yung awarding, this is only the turnover. We have also another um, schedule of contract signing na for the property. So, different po yun. Um, siguro po is, uh, uh, noong time na yun, Uh, sobra kami busy and talagang in-schedule namin siya na of course meron photo ops and yung maganda yung pag-turn over natin hindi lang siya basta na um, bigla na lang ibigay or gano'n. So pinaghandaan po natin yan. Okay. Um, kasi parang first time ito nangyari in a local pageant. So ang tanong ngayon is Magiging tuloy-tuloy ba pamimigay ng lupa sa mga pageant ng Palawan Real Property? Actually po, this is the aim that we are, uh, one of our goals of our company na gusto ng uh, Kasi po, isa rin sa goal ng company namin, not only to have a profit, uh, profit uh, oriented company, but also to help other individuals. So, isa po ito sa mga advocacy ng PRP na I think magiging tuloy-tuloy siya in the future dahil po marami naman tayo pupuksan ng project. And we are not only thinking about the pageantry, but also with the regards to the academics, or kung halimbawa sa mga mga valedictor, in the future, um, baka pamitirin po kami ng lupa. So hopefully, tuloy-tuloy lang, bigyan lang kami ng um, maraming blessings ni Lord, and uh, good health, 
para pa-achieve natin yung mga goal na ito. Yun lang naman. Apo. Uh, si PRP po is a it's a local company, right? <clears throat> Oo. Uh, of course, we, we know yung mga branded na mga real estate companies na so, nandito na rin sa Palawan. What do you think yung edge ng PRP over those branded uh, real estate companies na nandito na rin po nag-ooperate? Actually, kasi um, Palawan Real Property is already 13 years in the business. Um, so, ang aming edge is, of course, we are locals and uh, talagang um, aming target is yung mga local employed and uh, yung family natin is taga-Palawan talaga. So those are the things na advantages natin. And at the same time, yun nga po, yung aming mga binibentang properties ay mura kumpara sa iba. And at the same time, less hassle, wala tayong masyadong requirements as long as na makapagbigay uh, ka lang ng proof of income mo, you can already avail with our property. So, ito po mga projects na to, these are not only for profit. Actually, this is one of the social responsibility of our company, given na matagal na kami sa industriya. So, nakita namin na um, kailangan at napapanong muna para buksan natin at nakikater naman natin yung mga taga-palaw. So, yun po siya. Okay. Alright, Raven. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> So, anong plano? You have the lot now. May, may papagawa ka na ba ng bahay? Or yun yung next target mo, papagawa ng bahay? Thank you so much. Well, my mind right, like my mind right now, um, I'm, I'm thinking of looking at it as an investment. Because as of now, I still don't have the resources to build a house yet. But I know for a fact that this is my dream for my family to build them a house. Because we don't really have, you know, a nice house. I didn't really have a nice house growing up, like our own house. So I really want to work hard in the future so that when I have enough resources, I actually might not build a house, you know, as a gift for my mother. Pero like may target ka na ba kung kailan mo papatayo ito? Kasi lupa pa lang to, right? Yes. Oo. Well, that is where my priority is right now because of this lot. But I don't really have a time frame for myself. I don't want to push myself to my limits. I want to be gentle for myself. It's something that I've been working on right now. But of course, I still have my goals and priorities in life. And this is definitely one of it. But I don't really have a timeline. But hopefully with God's blessing as soon as possible. May mga nananalo kasi ng mga ganitong premyo, binibenta nila or pinaparentahan nila. Ikaw ba talagang gagamitin mo siya? No, I don't have any plans because I'm so grateful. My heart is falling with gratitude actually earlier because this is this is not a joke really. This is really a blessing from the Lord. And I just want to thank the RP and of course Mong Dona for giving me an opportunity to have this kind of land at a very young age. So I really want to treasure this and mark this as a historical day of my life, one of the most memorable moments of my life. So uh, I really want to see this lot, this lot or this land as something that, as a reminder for me to keep on pushing, to keep on moving forward, and hopefully I can have my first class here. All right. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Hi you guys. Ako ano? Ito ba yung first investment mo? Yes. <laughs> so, ano siya? Parang na-pressure ka ba? Yung parang feeling mo, hala, ano gagawin ko dito? Ah, kaya mo ba ito? Magpapangasawalan ko ba na may sarili akong lupa? Or you take is at, uh, you took it as parang challenge mo. Okay, ito na yung time na mag-invest na ako habang bata ako for my family. Oh, uh, I wasn't nervous that it's not really the right thing to describe my feeling. It was more like excited, excitement. Right now, I really feel excited really. Although there's a lot of emotions, coming out of me. Uh, excitement is really towering over all of this. So um, I'm really excited for my future on what the Lord has back for me. And again, I'm really not pressuring myself, but I really see it as a challenge for me to keep on pushing, for me to be more driven in what I want in life. And of course, for me to really look at the future in a different perspective, in a way that I can actually help my family, not just my community. Ano, message mo sa mga susunod sa yung mga queens, especially may mga ganito na pala, baka magtuloy-tuloy na from Ma'am Joan, may magtuloy-tuloy, ma-inspire sila to push talaga yung pag, uh, pagsali sa mga beauty pageants. Hindi lang for themselves yung physical na maganda sila, pero ito yung nagbibigay din kasi tayo ng, ano, ng opportunity, hindi lang para sa'yo, kundi para sa family mo. Message mo din sila para ma-inspire sila to join pageants. 
my message to the girls who are really interested or or who could imagine themselves in a pattern who really push for it. Because this um, opportunities like this, the rewards are just bonuses. But one thing that would really push them to their limits is their advocacy. Like for me, I joined the world of pageantry because of the children that I had been advocating for. And given this PRP, they, they gave me this beautiful gift. Although um, my heart is swelling with gratitude, I still want to push the girls to really pursue pageantry because of their purpose in life and because of their core, to always stick on their core. Because they will always find themselves lost in a moment when, when they are now in this industry. People will tell them that they're not good enough, that there's something that's lacking. And they will experience uh, mental issues even if they're not sure to their core and if they just join the world of pageantry just because they want to. So I really want them to find their core first. What is their purpose in life? Why are they doing this? And who are they doing this for? Because all these opportunities and rewards will come after, will come after their hearts of course. So I hope that uh, before they join the world of pageantry, they find their purpose in life and they really stick to their core for them to be able to um, rate their years um, entering their pageant successfully. May ano na, um, may balak na ilaban ka para sa next na ano. Sa so, ang Raven, Dr. Ba is handa na, ready na ba? Uh, preparation. So. Yes. <laughs> well, it's actually still up for discussion. Me and my team are still discussing it. Why? Because I don't want just to be physically prepared, but also mentally prepared for the challenges. I also want to give justice to the province of Palawan. So once the Palawan will be placed in my court, the sash will be placed in my court, I really want to give it a good fight. So we're still discussing it right now, but I am, but I am focusing on my advocacy. I, I go to rural areas um, most of the time today, every week actually, to look what they need to look for what they need and to know what they are still lacking, such as education inclusivity, for me to access where I can, where I can help, be a benefit of my community. And maybe um, during the days that I go there, because I feel like they are my source of energy, they are the reason why I keep pushing. So um, I am using my voice for a better use, and I am using my influence as Ms. Palawa Universe to be a better person. Yes. <laughs> so ayun, Ma'am Jonabe, so itong uh, pagbigay niya sa mga pageants, nabanggit niyo kanina education, meron na ba kayong mga target schools or personalities And, oh yeah, what, na parang inaayan niyo na? What about yung mga athletes sa mga yes, sports? Yes, uh, athletes. Uh, athletes. This will be one of the programs of our company, no? Uh, we are targeting athletes. Siguro yung mga, halimbawa, um, nanalo sa national or competition like this week, so uh, we will be also giving away. So you put, I mean athletes maybe also. So depende po. <laughs> Pero um, iniin natin is 10 years from now we will be developing at least. Um, sa ngayon kasi we are getting 300 clients. So maybe in the future um, 2,500 clients. Uh, that's our target. And I think that would be that entails a lot of uh, subdivision projects and uh, sana lahat po nung projects namin we'll, we will be giving away to any individual na deserving to have one lot doon so yun din po and yung isa po sa advocacy namin doon sa aming projects we will also be um, doing uh, offices for empowering women so yun po yung mga plano hopefully ay ating matupad lahat yan Ma'am, so far, ilan yung ongoing nating projects or property sa Puerto Princesa lang po ba? Yes, um, as of the moment, we have 10 already uh, in Puerto Princesa and then one in Quezon, but this is a simple subdivision. And uh, we are going to launch another project in El Nido soon. So, uh, most probably, ang aming target is Puerto Princesa because of the um, population also, no? So we are helping the local government uh, to um, eradicate the um, yung ating mga uh, nasa squatters area. So those are the main target of our company para maiayos natin yung ating housing projects dito with the help of our local government.
So, yun po ang ating mga um, gusto na gawin. Kasi minsan nakikita namin eh, sobrang dami na po. Eh, pag nagpamilya pa, so dodoble po ang, ang, ang population natin. So, we are here also to have this project in order na may organize natin uh, ng tama yung mga housing. So, yun po ang ating isa sa mga gusto. Oh, you're saying you're targeting yung mga homeless, mga squatters. Uh, you're saying na affordable po yung mga prices niyo. Yes, uh, we have uh, so low as 2,300 pesos monthly organization. That's uh, located in Manilista. So, nandun lang po sa mga ranges na yun yung gusto namin ibigay na affordable housing. Those are our targets and siguro maximum na yung 5,000 monthly. Oh. Um, just to clarify, yung PRP po ba is a developer siya or yung mga lots lang? Ano po ba yung classification natin? Actually, um, Palawan Real Property, um, origin, originally it's a general uh, real estate brokerage of buying and selling. So okay. halimbawa, kapag meron po kayong mga lupa na pinibenta, we have investors that we offer properties for sale. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, nag-evolve siya into... Um, uh, developing, we are already a local developer, um, catering the affordable housing. So, yun po ang ginagawa na namin ngayon. Aside from uh, general brokerage, we are also in that business pa rin. Okay. So, kung alimbawa ang mga sa susunod na panahon, um, we can uh, provide not only in Puerto Princesa, but also in other municipalities of Palawan. So, that's the dream and the challenge of our company na sana may ayos natin. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Message na lang siguro, ma'am. Message. Last message. Um, ang message ko po sa lahat, uh, hopefully, um, na magkaroon po tayo ng tulungan pagdating sa community, not um, only with, the, with us, but all the stakeholders, uh, sa pagkakaroon po ng murang pabahay dito sa Palawan, especially po ang ating local, local government and also like na, uh, model natin ngayon, si Ms. Raven, na sana um, sa pamamagitan ng tulong namin na naibigay sa kanya, um, deserve niya naman yun, hopefully in the future when she will become successful, she will also impart that success to others. So, para magtutunungan lang tayo. Yun lang naman po ang goal ng aming company. And kung meron pa po kayong mga lupa na gustong uh, ibenta sa uh, dito, sa Palawan, wherever po, um, nag i po kami yan. So, matutunungan namin kayo kasi we have um, investors coming every day doon sa office para magbili ng lupa. So, yan po ang aming may tutulong sa community. Maraming salamat po. And thank you for patronizing doon sa mga clients namin. Gusto ko pong magpasalamat dahil continuous ang pagpapatronize po nila sa Palawan Green Property.